Hi everyone, it's Winsome back with another origami video with a new um, coloured backdrop. Decorations are also different this time and I've got new nails which kind of match the background-ish. Um, so yeah, jumping straight into the video now. We are today going to be making the cat napkin ring which is another origami by J. Cole. Um, no particular reason why I picked it, it just looked very cute and I've never made this origami before so it's a first time for me so let's see how it goes. So as usual starting off with a square piece of origami paper, I'm just reusing um, instructional paper like usual. I'm going to first make a blitz base. So how do you make a blitz base is you fold the square piece of origami paper diagonally both ways like so trying to get it as neat as possible because this that's always something I struggle under pressure when I'm trying to do it as fast as possible and then next I'm going to fold all these four corners into the center so I'm going to also try and get it as neat as possible by following this line to each one yeah by following that line to try and get it as neat as possible in the center it's definitely one thing I always struggle with like it's such an easy base to do but it's also one that you can easily um not actually fold because of how precise you have to be like that but yeah it's fine it doesn't have to be too exact it's just like nice when it is. So then you've got your blitz base and then the next thing what you want to do is reverse uh, two flaps. So taking, uh, like opening any two you want, reverse and then fold them into the centre the other way. Oops. So like so, like this. And the next thing what you're going to do is to fold this corner and this corner up here into the centre. So that's one corner and then I'm just going to repeat with the other corner. I'm trying to hold down the flaps whilst you do it on either side so they don't become wonky later on. Um, so yep, that's how it should look once folded to centre and then next what you want to do is fold the sides, the four different sides here into the centre line so if you just watch what I'm doing because it's probably easy to watch, you're going to fold this up and this should line up to here. like so and then you're just gonna proceed to do these this same thing on the other four and try and press down hard because there's like this corner here which is overlapping maybe next time i'll do this on like plain regular origami paper because it always makes that like weird like noise like this because it's more plasticky kind of like mixed into this paper so yes now that you've got this what you want to do is simply fold this in half like so so satisfying when it's like perfectly folded and um, if you're not on the colour side yet the side with these two flaps then just flip over and just fold them up and then what you want to do is um, obviously this is called the 
napkin ring. So technically it was supposed to be made on fabric. Um, but instead I'm making it on paper because I don't have napkins at home. <laughs> so then what you want to do next is curl these around. And then I decide and then typically what you want to do is uh, insert one um, end into the other like so and then curve it more so it stays in place and then yeah this is the cat napkin ring um yeah i kind of wish i'd done it on plain paper so then you could be able to draw the face but obviously um this is coming apart now because obviously it's on paper uh maybe i can draw a face actually on this still let me find a pen um and draw a little kitty face on it you don't have to do this if you don't want to which actually if you made this on a napkin you wouldn't have been able to to do this and well I guess you can if you want to draw on your napkins but I'm not recommending you to do that especially if yeah it's not your napkins you're just taking ones out the cupboard um that are your pants uh yep cute little nose I'm following that yeah here's your oh my gosh i think i just smudged it <laughs> as i did that no let's try and fix it such a watery pen i didn't realize but yeah here is your little cat napkin ring and holding it like this because it's going to come apart if not so hope you enjoyed this video um comment down below what you thought about it like this video so i know you enjoyed this type of content subscribe for more content like this and other stuff i do um this is such a cute like the more i look at it like if this was made as napkin it would look so cute at a um kind of garden party to put them at each table so yeah that's it that's all i want to say stop i'll stop rambling on now so yeah as usual thanks for watching guys and i hope to see you next time bye <music>